out to secure one of the cages, you idiot. Get back there, what you looking at me for? You in quite a while. How you doing? I thought you want to kick the bucket. Nah, no such luck. <laughs> Fill her up. Bigger prices? I don't think so. Huh? <laughs> Twenty dollars. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta love high school girls. <laughs> we keep getting older, and they stay the same age. As we go out into the world, let us commemorate this day as the day we began our lives in earnest. And as we venture out on our own, let none of us forget she is so hot. Mm. Where we grew up, where we spent our smoking, day, working together in unison for one exceptional goal getting in your pants. Graduation. Our friendships, the trust will be the strength of our future. Our class may not be large, but we are a mighty He's still here, is he? Okay. Come on, come on, come on. I can do this. I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it. I know he's coming. Smile. Our town may not be big and modern. But Just grab me your hands. And make a hook over tonight. I think you're forgetting one minor detail. Dad's packing heat, man. He'd shoot me on sight. With no risk. No reward. Shh. I thought you didn't give a damn what super bitch had to say. I don't. I only graduate once. Come on. No problem. I'll get that. Just my daughter's graduation. Come on. May this town be 
a special meeting place for us all. Thank you for the best times ever. Some, some. Don't mind any beer with that. probably want to make it on town. Yeah, and I want a scholarship to Harvard. Are you going to be at the party later? Maybe. Just call me. I'll pick you up, okay? You better be. You better be. I'm going to text you. Joan. I didn't make it, did I? The ceremony started at one. Oh, man, I'm so sorry, Joan. I had a dollar for every time you said that. You'd be rich. I know. More like retired. The blueprints for the, the downtown loft they would do today. On the way here, there was this huge tractor. And... That's fine, I understand. Priorities. Don't worry about it. last night. I mean, just craziness. I, I wouldn't go in there. Hey, don't go in there. I'm warning you. Touch me again. I'm gonna put you in the ground. Back to shipping. He did. Well, he must be one stupid son of a bitch. I told you to shut up. Now take this. It's just a little monkey. Who do you think you're fooling? You think that I care that you killed your partner? Now I don't have to pay you. I didn't kill him. Look, I paid you for a plane full of animals. Now they all showed up in pieces. It's not gonna fly, Wayne. Lee's dead. The animal's dead. Things are a lot more screwed up than you think. Look, you're gonna take it back to China. Or else I'm gonna come over to that garbage heap in Hong Kong that you call an apartment, and I'm gonna take you out! Do you understand me? Got it. You got one week, Wayne. One week. Hey, little guy. Did you run away from home? Someone's looking for you. Hey there. This is so cute. <laughs> you have to come to the party. I don't 
don't think I'm gonna go. You better stay here and play with your animals. If it's that or watch the football team play beer pong, then yes. Whatever. I'll tell you what, though. I think Jason needs some attention. Just I'm not that into it. You would seriously rather stay here and smell cat feces than lounge poolside, sipping on margarita. <laughs> Um, yes. Precisely. Just checking. I'm out. Okay, see you later. Thank you. Tonight. What's up? It's all right. John, come on. I said I was sorry. What else can I do? Nothing. Mom wouldn't have missed it. You know, when she died, I didn't think I was going to lose both of you. Can I help you? Oh, hey. Uh, how you doing? Not bad. How about yourself? Uh, okay. Good. Can I help you find anything in particular? Got some interesting animals out of stores, don't you? Yeah. Actually, I'm, I'm looking for something special for my daughter. Um, seems like you have a lot of birds. It's, it's mostly birds here. How old is she? She's 18. Almost. Actually, she just, uh, Graduated from high school, starts college in the fall. She wants to be a vet, so. I think today may be your lucky day. Yeah. Wait right there. Oh. Your first one in a while.
Look, um, I've apologized about a million times at this point, so I'm not gonna do that. I know that, that this doesn't fix everything. What is it? Joan, the whole idea of wrapping a present is that the person actually wants to hold it himself to find out. Can't buy me off that. Look, I just wanted to get you something special. It's a monkey. It's a monkey, I know. You went out and bought me a monkey. I bought you a monkey. But what, you don't like it? I mean, it's not that, but it's an exotic animal. I mean, it's not easy to take care of. I know, I know, and I, and I thought of that, but I thought, uh, you know, the future veterinarian can't take care of a little monkey who can, right? Oh, my God. Oh, don't be scared. It's okay. Um, look, I know that it's not cool how many hours I've been hanging out at the office. But sometimes you just kind of want to throw yourself into something else, you know? It wasn't just a soccer game or a dance recital. This was my high school graduation. <laughs> it was so important to me. Look, it was important. Shall we take him out? I'm not playing with Jason. Okay, shall I monkey sit? Um, you know what? I can tell him another nap. No, you don't. You don't. No, I, I want to spend time with you. I mean, <laughs> I have a monkey now. We do have a monkey. All right, well, why don't you tell Jason to come over here and we'll... Oh, okay. Okay, sounds good. All right. Yeah. Can't be in a cage anymore. Okay. Oh my mm -hmm. gosh. <laughs> hey. Should I bring the cage? Uh, no. I don't want him ever in the cage again. Okay. So what's his name? His name's Skippy. Skippy? Yeah. Hey. I think he likes me. I think I likes you. <laughs> oh, oh, dude. <laughs> What's your dad going to do yeah. next time he misses a critical moment in your life by your tiger? Come on, did he even say he was sorry? Um, like ten times. I mean, look at what he got me. I didn't know by me a monkey sorry was an acceptable form of apology. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, he's trying. Gotta give him that. He's my dad, you know? I guess. You sure he doesn't have any diseases or anything? Yeah. I think he just is scared of you. Doesn't look <laughs> like my dad either. And I'm not a big fan of people. I think he just likes you. Maybe he just likes girls. Speaking of girls... Chill out, okay? Dinner's almost ready. Lame. This was supposed to be our night. Still is. We never have any time alone together. If it's not your dad, it's Sonia. If it's not Sonia, it's somebody else or something else. Now you got a monkey. How am I going to compete with that? It's always something with you. You act like spending time with my family is the worst thing in the world. What family? I'm sorry. Look, I'm on lack of sex, like a junkie is on withdrawals, okay? I'm going crazy. I don't like this. It's not fun. You shouldn't want to spend time with me to spend time with me. Not because you want to get in my pants. 
Whatever. Have fun with your old man and your stupid ass monkey. Jason! Thanks for dinner and the monkey. You're welcome. Um, I'm gonna make him a bed in the guest room. That sounds good. Hey, John. If Jason can't see how awesome you are, it's probably not worth it. Okay. Thanks, Dad. Let's get me. Look good, I got you. This is your new bed. No more cages, okay? Dad coming back? It's kind of freaking me out. I told you he's on duty all night. And what if he comes home early? <laughs> He'll shoot you. <laughs> Way to boost my confidence. It's not your confidence that I'm trying to boost. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Who are you? Who we are doesn't matter. Why we're here does. You work for the government of Greenpeace. So 
some other crap like that. You best realize that every man in this camp is fully armed and ready to fire. You've lost men in the night. Mysteriously ripped to shreds. And what little was left of them you found the next day. Am I right? How did you know that? I also know that you recently caught a specific monkey. And you sold it. There are only two of them left in the world. And the other one is nearby. What's that got to do with us? It's what's been killing your men. Monkey couldn't do that to a man. That's not a monkey. It's called a seagull. Something different. Something evil. They look like monkeys, yes. But at night, they change into something completely different. Demons. Demons? Demons, he says. That's great. Our family has been hunting this demon for centuries. I get paid to deliver animals, including those monkeys. That contract is canceled. We are prepared to hire you and your men to track for us. For what? For the next poacher they'll go for is you. Just bought yourself a tracking thing. Jason, you don't know. They're dead. They don't live together in their house. What? How do you know this? They don't tell the nose. Everybody knows. No. No. I'm sorry. My honey. I need to my dad. Hey, Dorothy, what do you got? Hudson from called. He wanted to know if you could push your 1 o'clock to 3.45. And Lemoyne, he needs a revision on the blueprints you sent yesterday. And when your daughter called, she said she tried to reach you on your cell. Uh, okay. Thank you. The seagulls were bred by a sorcerer to be soldiers. When killed, they come back to life. They duplicate. They become two new seagulls. When the sorcerer died, the surviving seagulls fled. How did you get into the demon killing business? Centuries ago, the emperor commissioned my plan to hunt the surviving seagulls wherever they had fled. They must be killed by our blessed weapon. Otherwise, they will duplicate.
I told you no guns. Yeah, and I told you we don't go anywhere without our guns. We have an agreement. I know. Bring the guns, but don't use them. Guns are gonna make it worse. Much worse. And how are we supposed to defend ourselves? You found and tracked one of them. I paid you to track, nothing more. Our weapons were left long ago. Only our weapons will stop and see you, not create more. No guns, Joe. So why don't you just bless our guns? Ancient demons require ancient weapons that were blessed long ago and passed down through our family. We didn't want you to sell the other monkey. He was their leader. There's another one left. We need to continue our hunt. Hey, hold on up. Just one. Find a son of a bitch. And when I do, I don't need no warrants or cuffs. Sheriff, don't you think this might be kind of early to start treating this like a murder? It looks like some kind of animal attack. Yeah. What kind of animal? There are no animals around here that can do something like that. Say in Africa. Yeah, we always play the game, right, BB? I need you to be with me on this one. It may not be straight. Are you with me? Yeah, I always got your back, sure. Come on, let's get into bed. You're the only thing that's making me smile right now. All right, good night. You sure you're feeling up to this? I mean, I can take care of this if you want. Maybe you should go home and get some rest. No, whoever killed my daughter isn't resting. Neither am I. Okay. Let's just get to the Tompkins farm and check it out. I'm not in the mood. I'd listen to him, Mr. Tompkins. What do you got? Around here. You ain't gonna believe the mess. I'm the best damn pig. What this? What do you eat? Uh, really, it's, it's a pencil right by my office. Why? 
He just won't eat anything, so I don't know. I was going to ask them what they're feeding him. Do you need a banana? Can I share? Yes. Thank you. Are you ready to go? Yeah, I guess. Are you going on the monkey food diet? Pretty much what I do eat. But Stevie hates that stuff. He doesn't eat anything. Just hope he's not sick. So what did he eat when your dad got him? Who knows? My dad was so worried about making up for graduation. I don't even think he thought about it. Hey, count yourself lucky. Some kids just get cars and trips to Europe. You got a monkey that costs nothing to feed. Hey, can we stop by the pet shop on the way home? Awesome there. Do you go with me? <gasps> Maybe I can get one too. <laughs> Heard him squealing last night. Came out with Old Blue ready to let fly at a pack of coyotes. Old Blue? Shotgun. Oh, but by the time I got here, whatever ate my hog was long gone. Got my dog, too. Love that little guy. Ripped him apart like the devil himself had a craving for pooch and pork. But you want to know the strange thing? Little trucks. I've done a fair share of tracking in my life. Whatever got my hog, ain't no coyote. Yeah, unless that coyote got himself a new pair of wings. <laughs> Promise, Joe. We'll get to the bottom of this. I was just wondering what you were feeding him. You know, I've tried nuts, grains, and fruit, but he won't eat anything. Got some birds. That's all he ate when I had him. <laughs> are those double yellow heads? Um, those are endangered species. You shouldn't have them or be selling them. What are you, some sort of animal rights freak? We run a legitimate business here. Um, I mean, I was just... I was just leaving. Well, thanks for the info. Bye. I want to thank you for helping us eliminate the seagull. There's one more in America because of you. We just saw the monkeys too. Some guys. Said they work for a collector. A name. We need to find them. You paid me to track for you. I did my job. We don't squeal on our clients. I'm gonna count to three. One. Spot on, I meant something in your world. 
too. Like he said, we don't know anything. We're just gonna have to shoot. The name. Yeah, I'll write, I'll write it too. Tell me. Rudy Marcus. He trades in trades in animals, right? How you doing, you? You hanging in there? Yeah, I'm fine. You know, if you need to talk to someone, you can come to me. You know that, right? Do you ever think about her? Yeah. Got you now, you sons of bitches. I knew they had wings. Oh, hey there, little guy. Where the heck have you been, huh? 
everybody is going to be glad to see you. Oh, I've got an idea. Let's surprise somebody, huh? Let me, uh, let me get this together. Where is the tray? Look what I found. Huh? Oh, my. I'm worried about you. You know, today being Jason's funeral and everything. I just want you to know whatever you need, I'm there for you, okay? Thank you. All right. Well, uh, breakfast is ready. I'll be downstairs whenever you two want to join me. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thanks, Dad. How's it go, little guy? What did you bring last night, huh? Can't run away like that, okay? I could get killed out there. Did you get hurt? <laughs> <laughs> tracks just like the pigs. Whatever did this swooped in, tore the old man up to smithereens. What we're doing with her is the same thing you killed Chastity. Sheriff, this is getting way out of hand. We need to call in the feds. Call him? But I'm not waiting for him. Took him two days to get here. Who knows what can happen in two days. Thanks for bringing me. Like I will let you drive today. And you know, just being there for me. Of course. Did you want me to come by? After Chastity's funeral? If you want. Do you think I'm a bitch for not going? What? No. <laughs> Are you crazy? The only reason I'm going is because our parents are friends. Okay. I love you. Mm, thank you. The Skippy has said hi. I will. What's up? I wanted to try and talk to you after the funeral, but you sort of took off before I could. So I thought I'd stop by. It's not a problem or anything, is it? No, it's fine. It's terrible what happens, you know? Jason. I mean, really, think about it. This could happen to anybody. It could happen to me. Yeah. I still can't believe it. Listen. What Jason did, I, I'm really sorry. Um, I'd rather not talk about it. But he knew how much I liked Chastity. We talked about it at graduation. He helped me. He was on my side. He told me how to make her like me, everything. But you know, after seeing what he did to the both of us, he didn't care about anyone's feelings except for his own. I don't really think that matters. Yeah, but you know what matters is I would never, ever ever exceed on you like that. It's been a pretty crazy day. And, um... I'm sorry. I'm just... All, all I'm trying to say is if you ever need a shoulder to cry on, someone to talk to, a hand to hold, I could be that guy. Okay, um... Thank you. Oh! Oh! You little monkey! You little bastard! Stop! Why did you grab that? Please, can you just go? Just
shown. I, go! recently flew to America. The monkey! Where is it? Where the hell are you guys? Interpol? Do we look like Interpol to you? Where's the monkey? What is it with everyone in this monkey? The monkey killed my partner. Ate the other animals in the cargo. I told him not to take it. You're going to take us to him. Screwers. Stupid ass monkey. What's that? Hello? No. That little monkey. Uh, you laughing at me? Is that it? You laughing at me, little man? That's cute. Guess what? You scratched my back. I'll shoot you. Take you home, little man. That old ass monkey. Don't have a mama. Do not. 
know. It's dying time, my friend. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, I'll be home just as soon as I make the uh, cash deposit. <laughs> Would you cut that out? You know I'm always careful. <laughs> Later. So I followed him. And then there were more. He killed Mr. Seitz. Wait, wait, wait. Just, we saw out who killed Mr. Seitz. Skippy! He grew these wings and he came really big and just flew out of the window and took off. Honey, um, look, I, I can't understand you, okay? I'm on my way home. All right, where are you? I'm at the gas station. Okay, go home, all right? Go home, lock the door. I'm on my way, okay? Sorry, Dad. I will. I will. Lock the door. Sheriff. Yeah, Sheriff. It's uh, James' mama. Um, my daughter. Uh, she just called and and she's at Sites Gas Station and then she said I didn't get all of it straight. She was very panicked, but she said that there was some sort of flying animal and it had 
killed old man Sykes. She said old man Sykes is dead. Like I said, she wasn't making a lot of sense. Look, I need you to do me a favor. Can you get over to the house right now? I'm about 20 minutes away. Okay. Can you get over there? All right, James. I'll be there in five. Okay. Thank you. I'll meet you there. Okay. Bombers. Head over to the Phyllis Station. James Palmer just called. Said his daughter witnessed the murder of Mr. Sykes. Said uh, some sort of uh, flying animal, whatever. Got him. Wait, wait, Sykes is dead. That's what you're gonna find out. I'm gonna swing over to James's place. And get a statement from his daughter and meet you back over there. I don't think the suspect will still be there, but if he is, you know what to do. Copy that. so soon? I'm assuming you didn't fly halfway around the world to say hello. You got my animals? Not exactly. Huh? What is this, your entourage? The monkey. Where is it? What are you, a cop? They're not cops. Then what the hell are you doing in my store? We need to know where the monkey is. It's right here. <laughs> Apparently you don't understand English too well. So my friend, Mr. Smith and Mr. Wesson are going to translate for you. I don't appreciate your presence in my store uninvited. In America, we call that trespassing. And I got every legal right to put you down where you stand. Show you. The last time I'm asking, where's the monkey? The soul is all right. To who? Give me a name. You owe me a check. It's in my pocket. I have a cast. You're coming with us. What the hell for? You got what you wanted. Put a face to the name. Get up. I think I'm going crazy, but that's what I saw. I mean, they weren't wearing a costume or anything like they that. They were eating Mr. Sights. Uh, that don't make sense. I mean, are you sure? Yes, I, I, I'm 100% positive. That is what I saw. Here, come in. Go ahead. I found a side cover here, but something big went down. Place crashed. I'm on my way. You're welcome to come along if it makes you feel safer. No, it's fine. My dad's coming home soon. Looks like that's him. Sheriff. I'm so sorry about Cassidy. Me too, honey. It's not your fault. Hey, James. Watch over here. Well, you guys call us. Don't up. All right. Thanks for checking in. Before. You should be too. I mean, everybody in this country owns a gun. And they love using them. There could be hundreds of them by now. We have to kill them here. you got lots of blood but no bodies no trucks no just like Tompkins place garage and see if they got a ladder and we'll check it out.
Lance is here. Hey, sorry it took so long. This place was hard to find. That'll be fifteen dollars. Thank you. Enjoy that pizza, sir. over a hundred times and she still isn't picking up. I can't get through to the sheriff either. We have to go check on them. Hold on, okay? I mean, we're not even sure they're in trouble, right? Okay, look, this is what I'm gonna do. I'll go by the gas station. I'll check on the sheriff. Then on my way back here, I'll go by Sonia's. See if she's okay. See if she wants to come back here and be with us, okay? No, I'm, I'm coming with you. Joan. I need you to stay here, all right? This is the safest place for you. I mean, if anything would happen. Okay? Okay. But you have to call me, okay? I will. I promise. Was right about what the flying bat monkeys they they they, they attacked the uh, baldridge in the pasture they came and they ate them they came after me one jumped on my back and i got in the shin and then they all flew away so you saw what joan was talking about like a, a flying bat monkey i'm saying i saw, saw exactly what joan described you're lucky she's still alive you know how to use one of these what do you think just take the safety off pull the trigger I got a bad feeling this has something to do with Skippy. I got to get back to the house. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa, whoa. What do you mean, Skippy? Skippy, my daughter's pet monkey. Whoa. How are you, Skippy? He gave it to her the day after graduation. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come here, let's go. It's quicker, safer, and I got tons of ammo. Get in. sugar bill and then we're gonna go check on John. back. Let me take a look. Okay. I'll be right here. Just keep your eyes peeled. What? Do you, do you see something? 
door's locked. It's probably around back. Let's, let's go around back. Scotty, the pizza kid. He swarmed him. Attacked him and ate him. Pizza's warm. He just had it. You know, maybe he, uh, maybe he's wounded and he's just hiding someplace. Is that possible? Let's check on the guard. Hey, get your gun out. See anything flying? Just point, pull the trigger. Hey, you can do this. Fine. I gotta get back to Joe, okay? You gotta call for backup, maybe the National Guard, okay? I, I really, I have to get back to my daughter, okay? Just hold on a second. Just, let me go back. Need to go to the Palma house. I can hear the gunfire. They're everywhere. What's with these fools and their guns? Let's go. Protecting those things? No. We're protecting you. You're making things worse. Okay, Bruce Lee. Feel free to make things better. Shooting them with your guns is only causing them to multiply. They only die when we kill them. Oh, well, well, hold on. Me and James have been killing them. That's why they backed off. They're calm because they come in waves. Trust me, they will be back. You seriously don't realize how they are increasing in numbers every time you shoot them? What are those little toys? These are ancient weapons that were blessed long ago and passed down through our family. We wouldn't have to be here if it happened any other way. A week ago, there were only two of these to-go's left on the planet. Now, because of all your shooting, look at what you have started! Hey! You son of a bitch! What'd you sell me? I didn't know. I thought it was just a monkey. Oh, you didn't know. I told him that monkey was bad news. Yeah, well, your dumb ass sold it to me, and you still owe me for the rest of them. Now's not the time! Look. I need to know everything you know about the monkey. I bought it from that guy right there at his pet store. Seemed like a great pet. It was very cute. They've been bonding. Bonding? Yeah! If one's been in your home, you should be dead. And you haven't noticed anything strange about him? I mean, to me, it... It, it really seems like he loves her. They're killers. At night, they transform and hunt. They don't bond. 
Your house is his nest now. No matter what he's like during the day, your daughter is in danger. We have to get to your daughter now. Let's get the hell out of here. Do you have a picture of him? Um, Skippy, um, yeah. That's Nico, not Skippy. Who's Nico? He would have been the last if I had gotten to him first. He leads the others now. How do we kill him? With a section weapon. All right, aside from using these blessed weapons of yours, what do we do? I mean, there's way too many out there to use just swords and arrows. He's the oldest of all the Sibo. We kill him and the rest die with him. Well, if he's this firstborn, whatever you call it, why didn't he kill me? Because he likes you. Nobody's ever tried to befriend or be kind to them. They've always been treated as the monsters that they are. When he comes for her, we will be waiting outside. Are you are you suggesting that, that we go out there and leave John here as bait? Yes! No! He will come back for her. We have to. No way! Dad, I don't think he'll hurt me. He let me live at the gas station when he could have easily killed me. Here. Take the weapons. Johnny. Find some place safe to stay. I will. Johnny. Find some place safe. All right. It'll be dawn soon. A monkey battle turning skippy when the sun comes down. Yes, it'll be easier to kill him that way. We just gotta wait, make sure he doesn't see us, and we'll be waiting for him. Take a couple of girls? <laughs> 
right at this. It's time to end it. I'm going in. No. Take Sonya and go someplace safe. Now. Don't go. Tell you to go someplace safe. I saved your life twice. I think you should be thanking me. Well, guess so. Uh, guess we're calling you that. Yeah, and uh, don't be bringing home any more pets. <laughs> <laughs> 